Folks, I've been having a lot of problems with my PlayStation 5 remote. It absolutely will not stay charged long enough for me to play my game, let alone long enough for me to pause Netflix, YouTube, or Amazon Prime nine times out of ten, with a few exceptions. Well, listen, James... For says, will draw an eye to God and he will draw an eye to you. John chapter 14 or 15 says, If you love me, keep my commandments. It's one of the two, but I'm not sure which chapter. So, so I have learned when, when anything like that happens, when any, when any kind of technical problem like that happens, it is just best to obey First Thessalonians 5, which says to pray without ceasing. That is a time to get on your knees and pray to devote as much time as possible to the Lord. That is a time to get on your knees and pray to want to worship the Lord and to spend as much time with Him as possible. And, and it is also a smart, smart thing to do if we pray that we won't get interrupted, or if we ask the Lord to teach us how to avoid or how to prevent being interrupted. If this video helps you, I'd like to know. If comments are turned off, that's by accident. Thank you. Please share, like, and subscribe. Psalm 100 A Psalm of Praise Make a joyful noise unto the Lord, all ye lands. Serve the Lord with gladness. Come before his presence with singing. Know ye that the Lord, he is God. It is he that hath made us, and not we ourselves. We are his people, and the sheep of his pasture. Enter into his gates with thanksgiving, and into his courts with praise. Be thankful unto him, and bless his name. For the Lord is good, his mercy is everlasting and his truth endureth to all generations. Psalm 101 If ye shall ask anything in my name, I will do it. If ye love me, keep my commandments, and I will pray the Father, and he shall give you another comforter, that he may abide with you forever even the spirit of truth. And I will pray the... If ye love me, keep my commandments. And I will pray the Father, and he shall give you another comforter, that he may abide with you forever. Even the spirit of truth, whom the world cannot receive. First Thessalonians 5, pray without ceasing.